It is Saturday, March 26, 2016. And, um, gee, I have all kinds of updates for you today. Let's see. Last weekend, I spent uh, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday at my uh, Mike Davies Boot Camp. I went uh, a couple years ago. I'm sure you can find a video somewhere. <laughs> and um, it was really great. As always, very inspirational, very motivational. A lot of working out and a really great time. It was really great to see Mike Davies, who's my online trainer who's, who I pay. And he sends me my Monday through Friday gym workouts and my diet plans and cardio plans. And uh, who I've worked with since 2008. And um, it was great to see him and my coach Shannon Gill and uh, all the other fitness people there. And um, it was a really great workouts. And uh, my heart pounded faster than it has in a long time, which is really good. Really sweaty workouts. Um, and it was awesome. And I was really happy because um, I was really nice and strong. And uh, that, that was really great to see compared to other people, you know. Um, my cardio was a little off, so I need to work on that. But having been working on my strength um, has really been paying off. And I, and I am stronger. So that was awesome. And um, it was really quite a feeling of accomplishment. Um, getting through the boot camp weekends, plus it was a lot of fun. And I'm going to move this a little. Since we're, um, we're all fitness people, well, you know, we're kind of competitive. So that makes it even more fun, <laughs> I think. So that was really great. And I stayed at my dad's. And um, that went really well. My dad's doing great from his almost near-death experience a couple months ago where his kidneys turned off. And uh, they came back on. And he's on... Um, Watching his diet really well now. He lost 67 pounds. He's really proud of himself. He does look really good. He's working out now. And in fact, I joined him in a workout in his apartment building, which was really great. Um, so that's fantastic. Um, fitness is really important. Um, and diet is really important. This is my week two in my vegan um, diet, new uh, way of eating, and I'm really excited. It's been going really, really well. I really enjoy the food. I enjoy the taste. I feel um, my body enjoys it. It's responding well. My strength is back. I'm not having a problem with my strength now. Um, I feel really nice and clean uh, internally, you know. Um, I have good energy. Uh, everything's going really well. I'm really enjoying it. I enjoy the food. Before I was um, covering everything in balsamic vinegar for years, my um, my bodybuilding figure diet, I just covered everything with balsamic vinegar because I couldn't stand the taste. And now I'm not even using my balsamic balsamic vinegar which is really awesome I enjoy the taste I still eat really clean I um, it's, it's good that I've had this background of clean bodybuilding eating because I I eat I'm eating clean vegan food I'm not eating junk food um, I'm doing a lot of research online and um, making sure I get the vitamins I need and uh, looking up protein counts and foods that are really good for you. So uh, I'm incorporating all that information and I feel really good about what I'm eating. And that is a nice feeling. Um, I still watch my portions of protein. I mentally, you know, I kind of, and I do measure my carbs like my uh, quinoa and my rice I, I do measure those in amounts like to what I had on my bodybuilding diet I'm adding lots of vegetables and uh, not too much fruit so I'm trying to kind of stick with the program as I know it and see how that goes today I, I took my measurements for the first time in years I don't like to measure myself or weigh myself at all I didn't weigh myself but I did do some measurements 
so I can start to track and I'm not binge eating because I'm allowing myself to eat what I feel I'm missing or wanting like if I want some almond up butter I'll have some so I don't binge on it now if I want raisins I'll have some if I want some nuts I'll have some so I don't need to feel like uh, I'm never gonna have it again or I shouldn't have it so I don't have to overload I probably you know I could cut back in areas but we'll see how things progress and when I am ready to you know cut back I will but we'll see how it goes I've been watching some really exciting uh, videos on YouTube about vegan um, eating and the health benefits are just tremendous health benefits that you can get from not eating animal par products so I'm really super excited and really motivated by bringing back health and wholeness and balance and nutrition into my body it's really exciting let's see I did also so I I ran a 5k race uh, the Sunday before boot camp the 13th and I had just started my vegan diet I did all the boot camp on vegan diet and um, I have a 5k today and I'll have a 5k next week and so things are going well my running's going well you know everything feels great so I wanted to update you on that um, let's see on the on the bad news I went to a podiatrist because I've had right heel pain for about a year now from running and the bad news is I have plantar fasciitis in both feet which means there's a tendon that runs along the bottom of the foot connected to the heel and it's inflamed inflamed wider in both feet he did an ultrasound and so I have some instructions on that icing and stretching and anti-inflammatories I'm not being very good on icing and stretching I'm trying to be good on anti-inflammatories and uh, he shot my heel with a anti-inflammatory and a B12 shot and it hurt so bad it was horrible and I need two more of those but I want I want it to get better I need to ice more I'm starting to ice a little bit it's cold so I, I never like icing because it's cold so this stupid movie program here is still causing problems I'm sorry about that let's see the weather is getting a little nicer sometimes in between rain so we're all very excited to see more Sun uh, I had a cold <clears throat> I was fighting over the boot camp weekend but um, now it's the end of the next week and I'm feeling much better I had a nice kind of easy week at work so I was able to recuperate um, you know all that working out and my cold throughout the week so that went really well and um, uh, I did my CrossFit yesterday as well so everything's really great and I'm really excited and I can't wait to see the changes my body's gonna um, experience and um, how everything goes um, I'm very excited and it's been a long time since I felt good about what I'm eating and and my diet so I'm really excited so I want to update you a little bit and I will talk to you soon. Bye.